tell me a little bit about your work in high achievement and what that kind of means to you. This is really my, my wheelhouse. I don't believe anybody wakes up in the morning thinking that they want to be average. I really believe that people want to be successful, but don't really know how to do it. They have the potential, they need a plan. And if I was going to come up with a plan, I was going to go to the most successful people who I could find. And I figured Nobel laureates, Olympic champions, astronauts, you know, those regular people. Mm -hmm. And I figured out that not only are they successful, but they have a lot of commonalities. So an Olympian is very similar to an astronaut. And I really deciphered what those similarities are. And then I created this blueprint for success. So anyone at any time can actually do it for themselves. I, I give them that plan. So success, I'm gonna tell you what success is. It's what my mentor told me. My mentor, when I was starting my research, he said to me, do something important, not just interesting. What is one attitude you'd like people to have leaving the podcast? Be fierce, be bold, be confident. And one behavior you would like people to do? Keep working at your goals and shed anything that's not directly related with your goal. And the best technique, tool, or tip? I think the passion audit is the first step because if you don't have that, if you don't have your passion nailed down, you're going to be spinning your wheels and running on a hamster wheel. So figure out your passion first. Thank you for watching this highlight video from the How to Succeed podcast. You can subscribe to the podcast on iTunes, Google Play, and Spotify, or click subscribe right here in YouTube to get notices about future episodes. And remember, whatever you are, be a good one.